What's up guys, in this video I'll be giving you my review of the Cyanogen mod running on HTC One M8. Now this CM12 works for all the variants so if you have an HTC One M8 AT&T variant you can install this on your AT&T variant. I'll be providing the files in my video description for the download and also step by step instructions as how to install this on your device. Installing the CM12 you will lose all the HTC One M8 functions like your HTC camera won't be having all the camera functionality and also other HTC built in stuff. But if you want to get the latest version of Android that is 5.0.2 along with the Cyanogen mod then go ahead to give this ROM a try. Before flashing anything you have to make an Android backup if anything goes wrong then you can restore the phone to its original state from the backup that you have made. The version of Android that is coming along with this mod is Android 5.0.2 which is quite stable I didn't find any lag or any force close of any applications or whatsoever. Related to the battery life, the battery life is also well known on the HTC One M8. Along with Cyanogen mod, it gives you a greater battery life and also good standby time. I almost got around 4 hours and 23 minutes of uh, screen on time using this CM12 on my HTC One M8 with somewhat heavy usage like watching YouTube videos, taking videos from my camera and also using social networking application on my phone. Related with the customization, you can customize your home launcher according to your will. You can also customize your status bar as in changing the battery status, aligning the clock at the center or customizing the date and time on your status bar. You can also customize your notification drawer by enabling the quick pull down, toggling on the show weather option on your notification header, rearranging the tiles in your notification panel. This mod also has theme engine available where you can change the look of your device by installing different themes from your Google Play Store or your Cyanogen mod website. Expanded option is also available where you will be able to get your full screen option available on any application. Double tap to wake is also there where you just have to double tap on your screen to wake up your device. And also double tap to sleep option on your status bar is also available in your display option. You also have button option available where you'll be able to control your music playback through your volume up and down. You can also customize your power button uh, according to your need. Navigation option is also available where you can customize your soft keys and also you'll be able to enable the option to wake up your device through your volume up and down. You also have privacy guard option available and also your blacklist option and also your whisper push option settings where you can manage secure encrypted SMS option. Performation option is also available where you can manage your profile and save a hell lot of battery life on your HTC One M8. Audio effects application is also available with this ROM. The camera works perfectly without any issues and I didn't find any blurredness or any dis uh, low quality photos or videos taken from this camera using the mod. You can also multitask in a very different manner by just pressing and holding your recent option where you will be able to multitask between two applications in a very smooth manner. So guys this was my review of the Cyanogen Mod 12 running on HTC One M8. Hope you guys like this video and if you do please do give it give, it, give it a thumbs up for this video and also do follow me on Twitter, Google Plus and Instagram and also do subscribe to my channel for the more Android content that I'll be uploading in the near future. Till then I'll be seeing you in my next video.